Hello fellow tributes, this is Catching Fire 3 with more Hotel Adu. Oh no. Oh what? No. The door. They told me. They told me that this was oh wait a minute. What the heck is back here? Did I just find something? Welcome, gentlemen, to Amateur Science. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. To science. I'm so confused. I don't think I was supposed to go this way. I have a feeling this is just like a little secret area. I don't remember having to go that way. Maybe I do have to go that way. I don't know though. Probably not. And I fell into the water. Great! That was just... Perfect! I didn't mind. I did not mind at all. I did not at all mind. You know why? Because I think I have to get up there. I'm going back in there. I'm just gonna go right back up there. What I want to do is get up here. Wait. And you are it. So, who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one on another on the limo ride over, so okay. let me introduce myself. There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our rich spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these yeah. pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary oh, so depending on the really manner in like. which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. <laughs> mantis. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. I'm pretty sure this is kind of weird. I don't exactly know where I'm supposed to go. I don't, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Well, let me, let me go out of the world or out of there to see if I'm supposed to go over here. Oh yeah, I think I'm supposed to come over here since the, those buttons would not be there unless You know, unless there was a, just for decoration, you know, but I highly doubt they would use the, the buttons as decoration. I know clipped around, I know I should have shown you how to get up here legitly, but I bet you guys can figure it out. You guys are smart enough. The pr 
probably figure it out by yourself. You may need to look it up, but I'm not sure uh, if you're smart or not. I do have to get over there, but I don't know how. Oh wait, I know how. Whew. This is where you need to go, Bedford. I just want to get it done quick, you know. Not waste too much time on one area as I tell you guys. Because also I don't know what to do. Ow, I'm, I'm like trying to pop a pimple or something. All right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Remember, the test is unsolvable without an Aperture Science Portal Quantum Tunneling Device. If you have not received one, please find a test associate before participating in any Shaft 09. Enrichment and activities. See, this is where it gets hard, guys. Sort of. Wait a This is pretty cool. It's like the f f kind of the first aperture. The lab it boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. So, what are we going to have? Can't go that way. Can't go this way either. Maybe it's this way. That's where I came from. Oh, one right there. Okay. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Um. Oh, right there and right here. I have nothing really to say except for this is awesome. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ooh. 
do not get how this works. Well, definitely not going that way. Got it. Oh, yes. in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. So you're saying even if I step on it, my feet, I have no feet! Wait, do I have feet? Hold on. Hold on. That's dark. It's dark. All I can see is a logo right in front of me. Oh my god, it's dark. That's probably why I didn't see my feet. Because it was dark. Hold on. Let's see, do I have feet? I have no legs! All these science fears are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. Oh, wow. Oh, I, 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 I totally didn't think about that. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't know where to go. I just cheat my way up there. But I need to do this legit now. The problem is I don't know how to do this game legit. These are the only white walls over here. There's no, that's the exit. There's no way over there. Oh, unless I can get up there. Oh, I see ya. I see where you're getting at now. There we go. Oh, maybe not. Oh, okay. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. I got it on me. I got it on me again. I think I'm gonna die. I did not do this legit uh, last time. So I have no idea how to do this. Can't press that button again. St Stop it! God damn it. Fucking hell. I, I hate them so badly. Can you guys stop up there? God fucking damn it. Okay. Hold on. Um. Sorry about that. Just being assholes.
No, no, no. I don't know how to do this, and also. Just a, just a, just a, just a, just a. Heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it, so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium. Could harden and vitro uh, vitrify my friend the wall? I don't even know what vitrify means. <laughs> What? What? I'm so stressed out. <laughs> it just like explodes because she's so stressed out. That would be kind of stupid if they added that in because she was like getting so stressed even though he slash she, because I don't know who it is, doesn't get stressed out really. Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. over here. Ha, ah, did you see that? I'm telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time entirely. Forward and backward. So do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. <laughs> wow. Okay, now I know what that is. Maybe if I go right here. Damn it. I could have done that. that I don't even think that's how you're supposed to do it either. Oh, there we go. I was like, where am I going? I don't know where I'm going now. Okay, let's see. Uh oh.
and I'm dead. Okay, I don't know how to do this. I don't know how. Yep, okay, good. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Finally open the gates. Nope. And put that there. Put that there. Just clean that off. Ha, ah, that's with a beautiful cube I know. Oh wait, that's not where it needs to go. It needs to go right here. Yeah! Now we're doing it. Why is our science not safe? You know why? Because the aperture science doesn't run that way. Aperture science does what Ap uh, what Nintendo don't. <laughs> Just like Sega don't do what we do. We do it way better than any of those other game consoles. We have freaking virtual reality in the 1990s. Congratulations! The simple fact that you're standing Nobody here listening has to it me means you've made a glorious minds contribution are too weak to, to understand. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. We're not going to release this stuff into the wild until it's good and damn ready. So as long as you keep yourself in top physical form, oh, there'll stuck. always be a limo waiting for you. Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. She is a gem. I am stuck here now. Where am I? No portable walls. Is that elevator to surface? I don't care. I just want to go to the surface, but I can't because I don't know where to go. Actually, put that down. Aha! Uh -huh. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. I have a feeling that I could spoil who Carolyn is. Uh, but I think you guys can already figure that out. Um, okay, let's see. I don't know what 
which way to go. There we go. Get on, get on. I have a feeling uh, GLaDOS is here. Greetings, friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. Not Cave Johnson. Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt... Sir, the testing? Right. Now you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in Phone danger? book of a contract? Answer those questions with a question. Who wants to make $60? Cash. You can also feel free to relax for up to 20 minutes in the waiting room, which is a damn sight more comfortable than the park benches most of you were sleeping on when we found you. So, welcome to Aperture. You're here because we want the best, and you're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Anyway, don't smudge up the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything, unless it's test related. True, but what I need to do is go up a floor, but there's no stairs. How do I do that? I probably put a portal up there somewhere. Actually, I'm... This is how I got up here before. I want to actually figure out how to get up there. I don't think there's a, sp a way to do it without no club. I'm not sure you guys can either tell me how uh, what I'm doing wrong besides the no clipping. Say, you're good at murder. Could you? Ow, oh, thanks. <sighs> Did you feel that? That idiot doesn't know what he's doing up there. This whole place is going to explode in a few hours if somebody doesn't disconnect him. I'll disconnect him. And unless you're planning to saw your own head off and wedge it into my old body, you're going to need me to replace him. We're at an impasse. So what do you say? You carry me up to him and put me back into my body, and I stop us from blowing up and let you go. Okay. Bye. No tricks. This potato only generates 1.1 volts of electricity. I literally do not have the energy. Why have I got you? You stabbed me. What is wrong with you? Do you have a multimeter? Never mind. The gun must be part magnesium. It feels like I'm outputting an extra half a volt. Keep an eye on me. I'm going to do some scheming. Here I go. Okay, I got my eye on you, potatoes. Where are we? How long have I been out? That extra half volt helps, but it isn't going to power miracles. If I think too hard, I'm going to fry this potato before we get a chance to burn up in the atomic fireball that little idiot is going to... I wasn't ready yet, though. Where's the moving platform? I have no idea where it is. There's no button. Oh wait, yeah, there is. Oh, I thought there was a button. Should, there should have been a moving platform there. Well, I guess it just, oh! Oh, I think I was supposed to go up here to get down there. <laughs> Did you see that? Parkour skills. Nothing in here. There's nothing of importance in here. Wake up. Somewhere I just know it. Do -do, do -do -do -do. Oh, 
Wait, how didn't they get rid of the potato? That's kind of weird now, isn't it? Especially because it's GLaDOS and I can't really take GLaDOS anywhere. GLaDOS, we can't take you anywhere. But Dad, no buts, GLaDOS. The real The testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Carolyn, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. Why did I just... Who is that? What the hell is going on here? I, I guess you know who, uh, you know who is Caroline? Carolyn? Caroline? supposed to do I know what I'm supposed to do so what you have to do is like you have to have the goo over here it's kind of hard because it like stops after a few ah my face Yeah, because of that. I don't know what I'm supposed to. Cube. I'm not cheating. I'm just using uh, a jetpack. I'm just using uh, one of those uh, jetpacks thingies. I forgot what they're called. They're um, Norwegian jetpacks, as most people call them. Weird. I, I think I've done this before, but that's kind of weird. Why is that not working? Oh, wait a second.
look at. As I said, I am a genius, but I am also stupid. See how stupid I am? I cheat. Not being Great able job, to... astronaut, war hero, and, and or Olympian. With your help, we're gonna change the world. This on. Hey. Listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. You do. It's Mr. Johnson. You're Caroline. Oh, shit. Oh, I spoiled it all. If you're interested in an additional $60, flag down a test associate and let them know. You could walk out of here with 120 weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, then put you back together. Good as new. Okay, let's see. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, wait a second. Okay, what I'm trying to figure out. Is how to get that cube now. So as I was told I should go down that way. I wasn't actually told that or anything. Just in case you guys were wondering. Oh, I need that cube. That's not gonna help. Sorry, I'm not going to be able to find this out. Where to put this orange one? That did not help. Where am I supposed to put this? I don't know where to put this. not help. Sorry, I... Uh, well, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more, subscribe if you're new, and may the odds be ever in your favorite. Bye.